All right, y'all. So on Friday, Warner Bros. Discovery CEO David Zaslav gave an update on the next Game of Thrones spinoff series, which is, of course, A Night of the Seven Kingdoms, The Hedge Knight. Um, so we'll see what he says about this and about the release date. All of that. Let's get into the article. Creator and executive producer George R. R. Martin is in pre-production for the new spinoff, A Night of the Seven Kingdoms, which will premiere in late 2025 on Max, Zaslav said. Given that House of the Dragon is launching its second season this summer, the Night of the Seven Kingdoms date next year raises the possibility of HBO settling into a flow of having a Thrones drama each year. Yeah, we're going to be eating, y'all. <laughs> we're going to be eating, y'all. That's exactly, it's exactly what we deserve. Game of Thrones on our screens every year. It's what, it's what we live for. Okay. <laughs> Assuming both shows can turn around their next seasons within two years. I think that's very possible. Um, he said, as I've said, looking ahead, we've got one of the best lineups in the history of HBO. He talks about hacks, um, House of the Dragon, the Penguin, the new Dune series. He's talking about White Lotus, The Last of Us, which I am excited for. They said filming is going good for that. Um, I think Petro said that. And also Euphoria. I, oh my God, y'all still doing Euphoria, girl? We still do. We still don't know what's going on with Rue in that fucking suitcase. <laughs> what happened? That monotone ass drug dealer girl. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. This is not about. It's not about you for it. But it's like, God damn, you still y'all still doing that shit with Sam Levinson, weird ass. Anyway, okay. Let's get into it. <laughs> As reported earlier this month, HBO is also developing an Aegon's Conquest prequel series. Everybody rejoice. Everybody rejoice. Everybody rejoice. We're going to see Beleriand the Black Dread. We're going to see the Black Dread. We're going to see the Sister Wives. We're going to get into it. We're going to get into the burning of Heron Hall, bitch. You bitches are so silly. You bitches sat your ass in that castle and got cooked. Y'all bitches got cooked. Get into it, honey. Of course, Madsen Tomlin will be the writer on that. Other ideas set in Martin's fantasy world are also in development though only House of the Dragon and Night of the Seven Kingdoms have been greenlit. It's going to be interesting because they're talking about um, the Sea Snake stuff being animated. So I can't wait to see like an animated world um, when it comes to Game of Thrones. So it's just, they, they're coming. They're coming with it. They're coming with it. And like I said, y'all need to stop playing with me and make sure by the time Aegon Conquest come out or about to come out, y'all need to be developing both, uh, you know, a show about Nymeria's ships and all that shit. And y'all also need to be developing an old Valyria show. 100%. 100%. I need to see what the fuck caused the doom. Don't play Don't play with me, y'all. Like, And by that time, y'all should have the, the CGI and all that shit for the dragons down. Like, Y'all should know what y'all doing by that point to be able to put 10, 15 dragons in the sky at a time. You know what I mean? When we looking up in old Valyria, y'all should be able to give me the sets and costume designs and all this shit that I need. Y'all need to give me old Valyria. I'm screaming at me jumping ahead of, or be, you know what I mean? Jumping further into the past, even further beyond Aegon's Conquest. But I just need Valyria. Like, I need to see it. I need to see it so bad. So, as we know, The Hedge Knight is based on Martin's popular trio of Dunk and Egg novellas, which chronicle the story of Dunk, um, the future Lord Commander of the Kingsguard, Sir Duncan the Tall, and Egg, the future King Aegon the Fifth Targaryen, as they wander Westeros having adventures roughly 100 years before the events of the novel. Right? The description of the show reads as follows. A century before the events of Game of Thrones, two unlikely heroes wandered Westeros. A young, naive, but courageous knight, Sir Duncan the Tall, and his diminutive squire, Egg, set in an age when the Targaryen line still holds the Iron Throne and the memory of the last dragon has not yet passed from living memory 
uh, great destinies, powerful foes, and dangerous exploits all await these improbable and incomparable friends. So yeah, there wasn't much on that. There wasn't much news to divulge there other than like, okay, we get in 2025, they're working on the shit. Um, but yeah, like it, like the um, article said, it will be great to exist within a time, right? Where there is, there'll be Game of Thrones on our screens every year, no matter what. So it's like, y'all just keep it coming. Make the Thrones, you know what I mean? Cinematic universe, get us excited do what you have to do um and yeah that's it Aegon's conquest like i said we need nymeria we need valyria get into it um but yeah on that that's all i want to talk about on that note thank y'all so much for watching and i will catch y'all later Peace. all right y'all make sure that you're going to www.zeraxia.com when you join the wait list there on the site you will be the first to be notified when i drop my sequel also you'll immediately get chapter one of my upcoming sequel of the upcoming book uh sent to your email as a pdf so check that out also this is a different excerpt uh from my upcoming book so you definitely want to pause to read if you're trying to get your life uh keep in mind that this upcoming book the sequel is following up the first book that is already released called zaraxia wrath of the god king um, I released it a couple years ago, a few years ago. It was my, really, it was my introduction to writing, uh, fantasy and stuff. So just go easy on me. But either way, as you can see here, it's given 4.9 stars. It's given 4.9 stars. So yeah, check out Zaraxia Wrath of the God King. While you wait for Zaraxia, the vengeance of cold wind, right? And go to Zaraxia.com, sign up, join the wait list, get your free chapter. Thank you so much. Thank you.